Hey guys, it's uh, Jeremy Padauer, the Godfather. Whoa, time out, guys. Jeremy Padauer's doing an intro to the video? Unbelievable. Obviously, the guy is the Godfather of wrestling figures. Uh, Jax, back in the day, he brought it together, really. He is the reason why wrestling figures are what they are now, in my opinion. And the Adam Bomb Jax classic, one of my favorite ever. Anyway, let's get back to it. Hey guys, it's uh, Jeremy Padauer, the godfather of modern wrestling figures, and my two dogs, Ruby and Oswald. And uh, we're about to check out AJWF and uh, their figure fed content. Uh, because, uh, you know, these dogs, they're totally into it. I'm telling you. And I'm going to check it out. Good luck. Bye. Welcome back, guys, to another AJWF. Come on, Jeremy Padauer. Wow. Anyway, today's video is the Chris Jericho ringside exclusive. AEW's little bit of the bubble. Let's see what this one's all about. It's got to be said, guys, the packaging for this ringside exclusive. Absolutely unbelievable. Whoever came up with the idea, they deserve a medal. It looks just like the champagne bottle. It's absolutely brilliant. Um, obviously, you know, I open a lot of these figures. This one, it's a shame to open, but we've got to do it. We've got to let it breathe. Um, but just check this out. I will give you a 360 of the box in a minute because I'm that impressed with it. Uh, just check out the back as well with the old Jericho picture here. It just looks like a classy design, doesn't it? It's all good. Uh, ringside exclusive, like I mentioned. So good. Well done to AEW and well done Jazzwares for designing and making this thing. So let's get on with giving this box the 360 treatment for all you box lovers. And even I'll admit today, this box is a work of art. Do remember guys, if you like what I'm doing, hit the thumbs up below this video and subscribe to my channel. It helps me out, but without further ado, let's get inside this thing. Let's pop it open like a bottle of champagne. Uh, plenty of sellotape, don't play with knives guys, remember? Let's get inside this thing. In fact guys, you know what, before we open this, let's do the old t-shirt check. It's been a while. British icon, the British Bulldog shirt today, the old Heart Foundation one. He is a British idol and I'm a British broski, so it goes hand in hand. Let's hope, once I've edited this thing, that you've just heard a bit of the old British anthem. <laughs> but anyway, here we go. Let's get this box. Comes, to, ooh, look at that. It comes apart in pieces. Uh, you can see there the mould on the inside. Uh, really good touch. I do like it better when the top of the box is hidden like that. Uh, it looks more like the champagne bottle, doesn't it? Let's not wreck the illusion. But here we go. Here's the figure. Mr. Chris Jericho, great figure, great t-shirt as well. And look at all these accessories. Obviously got the world title and all the bits that go on the old, uh, what is it, like a catering table in his um, promo. I'll probably pull that up later as well. So let's get this figure out of the box. Uh, it does look like a good one, so I'm happy to have it. Um, it's not coming off. Let me pull this bubble out and we can try and get at it this way. Oh, look, <laughs> breakaway table behind there. I almost missed that, to be fair. Uh, good job I brought the bubble out, isn't it? Um, but here we go. Let's push him out and pop this figure and let it breathe okay cool looking figure don't know if the camera's picking it up but just there you can see it's got the plastic that covers up uh, the body part so that if the t-shirt dies or anything like that it won't go on the figure which is a nice little point uh yeah all around tattoos look amazing uh head scan looks good feels really bulky it's, it's a strange one to explain but yeah really cool figure um one of the eyebrows is really long though that's random i'll take a picture later to show you uh, let's check out the accessories obviously the table here let's set it up and we'll set up catering for him as well okay so i've got no dudley boy figures lying around so this table should be safe uh, look at all these accessories it's so good uh, let's start off let's get this bucket out it's what you put the champagne in um if i just tip it there look you can see it's got like the ice it's like an ice bucket it's a good little touch just going to grab these two champagne bottles as well, um, just so you can see how they sit in the bucket. Nice and easy. It is worth pointing out as well, if you can just notice, one of the bottles is open and one's closed. Nice touch to detail there. We know Chris Jericho is a man who likes his bubbly, uh, so it is good that even in figure form, it gets to be in a nice little ice bucket, nice and chilled for him. Sip it up, Jericho, because so far this figure is a really good one. Uh, let's get on to the next bit. Uh, what should we pick out next? Little party cups, look at those. Attention to detail again, really good. So let's grab all these little food bits out. Uh, this green stuff in the little pot, um, I don't know what it's called. Don't hate me, I'm not scripted, I do apologise. Um, but the rest you can see, like the tray with the salami, the crackers, etc. on it. All good, nice little touches. Again, detail is great. This is a really good one. Well done to Jazzwares. Look at this, look at that. Cheap salami, that's what Chris Jericho gets. Bunch of crap, look, olives. Look at this, look, 
this olives are nothing in there. And you look at this one, there's a little guy in there. Can't even get proper olives, can ya? What else we got? Oh, a little bit of the bubbly. Want some bubbly? Look at this stuff, huh? And last but not least, you get the microphone accessory because Chris Jericho, all through his career, he's been the king of promos, hasn't he? Uh, put a mic in his hand and he's gonna make it gold. I did love all when he had the list of Jericho. All those promos were great. Also, his stupid idiot stuff. Let's see if I can you find it. You disrespectful, stupid idiot. What are you babbling about, you bag of bones? You don't even work here anymore, it's Teddy Long, you stupid idiot! <laughs> he is literally, probably, one of, if not the best guys to work the microphone. Such a great professional wrestler. And of course, this figure also comes with the AEW title. Uh, he was the first one to win the belt, and it's represented of this figure. Because I'm the first AEW champion. And that is exactly what I just said, Jericho. Um, but here's the title belt. You can see the detail on the belt as well is extremely good. Um, yeah, happy to add this to the collection, to be honest with you. Um, so far, so good. Uh, yeah, really, really good. I guess the only thing you could say is the skin tone on the figure. Obviously, it's the older skin tone, which is not, you know, it's not ideal, but it kind of makes it unique, I think. Uh, here's a quick overview of it as well. I'm going to take some pictures uh, so you've got it up close as well, and I'll get that shirt off so you can see what it looks like. Um, but for now, here's the 360 on the screen as we speak of the guy in the figure shirt. And I will take that off for a 360 as well in a minute. As if by magic, let's remove the shirt. Uh, I think this also draws more attention to the tattoo, which is really good. I'll try and get some close-up pictures of it because, you know, it stands out. It's really, really good. My only qualm with this figure is probably the eyebrows. Just, I don't know, they don't look right to me. Is this how it's supposed to be? I can't recall. I haven't got my Series 1 Jericho to hand to check. Um, they just seem really long. Do just want to give a quick shout out to wrestlebox.co.uk who i got this figure from for a nice bargain price use code ajwf if you're shopping there because it'll save you money and why wouldn't you want to save money let me grab some more photos for you of this jericho figure in the shirt out the shirt and obviously with all the accessories that really do make the figure complete it is a little bit of the bubbly themed uh, the box obviously is a work of art uh, but it's really good that jazzwares managed to get all the pieces from the promo in the box with the figure so good I am a fan of the t-shirt that it comes with. A little bit of the bubbly, it's a good touch. The only thing, again, I'm just trying to show you here on these pictures, the eyebrows, are they wrong? Tell me in the comments, or am I just overlooking it and overthinking it? Here's a little quick overview of the whole figure for you with the fig shirt on before we strip him back um, to show off his torso, I guess. <laughs> again, the tattoo detailing, incredible. I will get some pictures close up uh, just so you can admire it because it really is good. As mentioned earlier, he was the first AEW World Champion, so let's put the championship around his waist. As you can see, it scales well with the figure, and here's the tattoos again. I'm going to try and get closer. Uh, I hope that does pick up on the camera, because they are really, really good. I know I keep mentioning it, but the tattoos, they are really good. I'm going to try and get even closer here. Uh, bear with me. So I'll get some photos on the screen, hopefully now, um, so you can see the detailing. Because, uh, honestly, in hand, it is such a good touch. Let's just take a quick look at the attire here. Uh, it is mainly all black with the odd silver touches. Uh, the boots on the figure are worth mentioning. Really detailed, they look really good in person. Uh, I'm just going to grab it all around, sides, back for you, uh, before we look at the accessories. So let's take a look at these accessories that come with it. Obviously the breakaway table, which is always good. Uh, the uh, ice bucket with the little bit of the bubbly. It wouldn't really be the figure without that. Uh, all these, even the party cups, the snacks, the microphone he's holding, they're all really good. To say it all came from a promo that he did on the wing, apparently. Uh, fair play to Jazzwares for creating this and making it possible. As you can see from the picture, you can pose the Jericho with the little bit of the bubbly. Oh, it looks like he's got company. Here comes Lana. Maybe she's after some of the bubbly and it's being offered to her. Hang on, Lana. Enjoy the bubbly because here comes the 24-7 champion, Velvet Sky. Uh, does she want some bubbly? Jericho is telling Lana to give her some. I don't think he quite meant like that. Lana has sprayed down the AJWF 24-7 champion and she is out of here. And Jericho, what's he thinking? Uh-oh. Snack time for Lana, I think. Yep, she's getting a face full of salami. Wait a minute, here's Dana Brooke. She's picking up Jericho. Oh, this is going to end badly. 
Oh, he's going through the table. Oh, he's gone through the table. Dana Brooke finishing off Jericho here. What is going on? Well, guys, bit of fun there to end it. Uh, but thank you very much for watching. And a big thank you to Jeremy Padawa for doing the intro to this video. He's a busy man, obviously. And the fact he took time is well appreciated. And do remember, AJWF code saves your money at wrestlebox.co.uk and also at Ultimate Figure Shirts. So save some money. And if you haven't already, hit the thumbs up. Uh, check out some more of my videos on the channel because hopefully you'll like them. And do subscribe to the channel because I appreciate you all doing it. Drop me a comment. I will reply as soon as I can. Uh, and again, I appreciate all of you for taking time to watch this. This has been AJWF.